Once again, a matchup that Dill is not exactly out, exactly unfamiliar with. We do have uh, Jen who hasn't come back. Uh, Jen, come back, we miss you. But she is very well aware of this matchup. But we don't see See him playing a really, really intense, aggressive Palu. He is not afraid in getting in there and going in with his up air juggles that he is not gonna find because Dill has high recovery. Oh, and oh! But if you go too high, you're getting zero to death. That's funny. Oh my god. I wasn't expecting that at all. Nowhere is safe from the Palu up air. Because it comes oh, out not so again. quickly. Oh, I heard Devin say no so <laughs> fast. Right, and still just no percent on C right now. Dill able to oh, no. get away onto the ledge, but now you're stuck on the top platform again. I really like what C was doing there by threatening, you know, just making Dill get that shield ever so smaller because we know C loves to go for those shield pokes. All right, great call out on the teleport cancel. That's something you've got to be aware of against a, a Palutena. Yeah, definitely, of course. But, you know, C now has a complete stock, like, above, uh, above Dill. And that's so scary, the first, like, I was just saying, very aggressive power player is not afraid to chase you down, you know, Dill has been, now, we were saying don't challenge Dill, you, know, you, you can challenge Dill a little bit, you know, with up air. Oh my god, using the gyro against Dill, not getting any post-flame kill, but possibly getting maybe a back air, maybe down tilt, maybe down tilt right here, no, getting Ooh. lasered. That was good patience by C, but just wasn't ready for the laser there. Now, Dill on her last stock of game one, trying to take a moment to compose herself while C sits comfortably with his three stocks. And oh this no, is not and a the fun Nair game. train continues. All right, doesn't uh, get the pivot back to center stage. Um, so Dill hits off early there. Now Dill perhaps looking for an up air kill of her own, but again, the Nair train just comes through. It's still such a dangerous game for Dill. She didn't bring it back at, at all. But, you know, C is playing such an aggressive way. There's almost no way that Dill can really uh, go in the way that she wants to. When she tries jumping, she gets upper just oh, like that and no. taking the first game so quickly. That was really fast. That was rough. That was a, that was a three stop. Yeah, it was. Oh, I hate that. She's so pretty. Paolo is so pretty. Yeah, like we were saying, you can't. Uh, yeah, yeah caught Dill. catching Dill's jump like that, knowing that she's gonna recover all the way in the top of the top top of the platform, and right here, uh, just kept going in. There's no escape. She's like, come on, back down. Do it. I dare you. Dying at like uh, 60. You know, Rob's Rob's big. Gonna get hit by those. Rob's big, and Palu up there has a huge hitbox. I feel like. I feel like it catches you everywhere. Really oh, does. going to Palos. Interesting counter pick for uh, for Dill, but likely to to make completely just negate the use of any top platforms that will keep her up in the air like that. Yeah, but already see oh, putting no. these Kalos platforms to work, already getting a quick 52 or 50 rather, and um, keeping Dill uncomfortable at this ledge. What? Hello? Okay. Yeah, no, Dill uh, neutral get up yeah. there. Yeah, that All that right. keeps messing C up up in a lot of these bracket matches. And uh, the, the thing about Palu is that you can completely erase the top platform. That's fine. She won't up you as, as often. But now you gotta do with Palu's Palu, uh, back air and forward air off stage. Yeah, no, Palu, Palu is no slouch when it comes to having tools in neutral. And, you know, removing platforms not gonna be too much of an issue for C Solid right back now. Air. Yep. That'll take it. That'll definitely take it. Yeah. And I mean, Dill doing better than she did last game, already uh, having some percentage on C, but the Nair just keeps coming. No. And it, it, and just keeps and it coming. don't stop coming. Thank you! <laughs> and don't stop coming, don't stop coming, don't stop coming, here come the back air. My fault, oh, sir. that's my fault, that's my fault. Here, no, go. here we go. Oh, okay, finally getting away from the up air. But it's just, this is just a precarious situation for Dose. That's because she's only been able to get 56% on C, and C, he is just going crazy. I really like how C really isn't going for the gyro at all because he's he's just been so confident in his play right now. You know, at that point, why throw a variable in? Why throw something? Oh my god. Why do you need variables when that happens? Oh, but great drag down up there into the F smash. Dill finally on the board, but. With but by a, how much? A veritable mountain to climb right now. See on his fresh second stock, while Dill's last potential last stock of of the bracket is slowly fading away. Oh my God! It, 
I, I, I was actually gonna comment that the fact that this this page this this page this stage is a pillar stage is might be a, a, a disadvantage for something like Rob who does kind of require a little bit more of like leeway in terms of uh, under the under the stage kind of play. And I, like you just saw, converted right to a dare and took out the Sakasak so quickly. And great timing on C, but not going to be able to capitalize on it. Dang that. C, oh, covered, not, 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 C not, yeah. covered so many options by throwing the gyro at his feet and then setting up for the F smash. Oh, and another, another up, up air there. to catch Dill's jump. Dill is now jumpless off stage. And also getting that back air off stage. She is now stageless. Jeez. Wow, I, I just want to see that second stock after we see the final hit. That was Boom, bam, bop, back that was hit, back frankly hit. Yeah, a yep. that was frankly a rough set. This was this was detrimental. This was just devious. Oh, oh, Dill tried to excited. come up with a hitbox, but C was just barely spaced outside of it. And this this, this is also still a really good kill right here. Yeah, catching and Dill. Uh, I was like, oh, I'm on front. Yeah, Dill's bear. Yeah, here's a side B, has oh, invisibility, no. and goes down and just dares her down. That's unfortunate. Yeah, that side B just that's, lasts that's the entire invisibility. Right but that's good on C's reaction time for that. And able to convert into, like, convert his, uh, his 